Howdy YouTube! Darlington Farm here. Well, as you can see there, I got a new tool. Uh, been a really long week. I've been working out of town. I'll put some pictures up here so you can see what I've been up to. So as you can see there, those are the flanges uh, that I was making on the lathe there a while ago. I didn't end up having time to video those. I was kind of under a ridiculous time crunch to get them done. Uh, suffice it to say, the flange that's built into the bottom of those, that extractor there, the threads are all stripped out in the, in the where they those vertical pipes bolt up. Um, just made a two inch spacer there, welds on the bottom of there. Uh, Easy project, just, you know, kind of mild steel there. Everything else there is 304 stainless, and it's been kind of an interesting experience uh, making all that stuff. Uh, working with a guy that's been doing it for eight years, and I've been kind of learning everything I can as I go along there. And Anyway, yeah, it's been a, an interesting project there. I got some more stuff to do down there, and some holes to drill, as you're gonna see here in a minute. So, if you are in need of any power tools, I would highly recommend quality tools uh, down on Harding Street in Indianapolis. Um, I bought this guy there. Uh, they did not have one of the annular cutters that I was asking for, so they threw in a free battery, which was like one of these nine amp hour batteries, like a hundred and sixty dollar battery. Of course, I'm spending you know two plus thousand dollars on this thing, and so they threw in a, few, a new battery, which was nice. Uh, ended up being $2,222 just for the drill, and then I bought a buttload of annular cutters while I was there, and uh, yeah, so they uh, they hooked me up with a spare battery, which uh, or an extra battery rather. It's out in the truck. I haven't brought it in yet. Uh, they threw in another one of these high demand 9 amp hour batteries here, which I was pretty happy with them. I, they definitely didn't have to do that, but they went ahead and did, and so I was very excited. So yeah, basically this is a mag drill. If you uh, <clears throat> have seen my other videos, I've got another big Milwaukee mag drill that I absolutely love, but I do not love moving it uh, because it's like 100 plus pounds easy, um, not a party to move at all. This guy I can pick up with one hand here. So it is you know, not an easy, super light thing to lift, but it is, uh, yeah, even if uh, Darlington Farm Jr. here can lift it. Hey, put it back before you drop it, dude. I don't want you to drop my new drill on the floor. Anyway, basically I have a bunch of holes on a vertical uh, tank that I got to drill out, and this was going to be the easiest way to do it. So uh, I just went ahead and got the chuck on this guy, and, uh, or the, not the chuck, Boy, it's been a long week down there. Anyway, I got the kit on this guy, which came with like the chuck, extra batteries, and a whole bunch of other crap here. So anyway, yeah, I'll do another video on this here, like an actual review once I use it and have a few minutes to actually take a breath. And anyway, I gotta get the batteries on the charger for this guy. And uh, like I said, I gotta use it Monday. Normally this is something I would have waited and just bought used. Wasn't real thrilled about having to buy it new and spending, you know, like I said, 2200 bucks on it, but I need it Monday, basically. So, anyway, I'm Darlington Farm. Hope everybody has a good weekend. I will be back down working in my undisclosed location there, and um, yeah, hopefully I can get some more pictures for you. Thank you for watching. Have a good weekend.